Uh, we are going into Sergeant Meet Sergeant Knox in the uh, Protector's Enclave. We're going to do the Finding Honor quest. So we're going to accept that. And then we're going to uh, start following the path. Alright, so yeah. Um, dude, I, I've always wondered about that. Like, who raised fucking, you know, Chucky's kid and shit. But, but uh, it, it was... Yeah. I, I was... I really hated that movie, though. That Seed of Chucky, that was just the dumbest. You know, it just... I, I kind of dealt with Bride of Chucky okay, but, you know, Bride of Chucky's alright. But, but man, the fuck, that Seed of Chucky was a joke. You know? Yeah. Right? Yeah, how did he get his arm again? No idea, right? But, but it's, you know, with, with Chucky and, and horror movies like that, you kind of have a little leeway back and forth of, uh, you know, things that don't make sense and shit like that. I, I'm really excited because I've been reading about the, they're doing a new Chucky, and it's gonna, yeah, well, you remember how they took her into the, uh, insane asylum at the end of the last one, and the end of Curse? Well, they're gonna put her in the same uh, insane asylum that uh, the mother, like the original mother is in. So she's going to be back for the next movie. Her and the original Andy, yeah. Because they said, they said at the beginning of part two that, uh, you know, she, she didn't change her story. So they put her in an insane asylum. Alright, Sniper. Get sniped, bitch. I'm gonna grab that. Dude, when this guy walks around, he looks retarded. He looks like he's got a stick up his goddamn ass when he he's just he's walking with his hands and he's like Arr! And I say that every time I play this. Every time I play this I say this guy walks like he's got a motherfucking stick up his ass. It's pretty funny. Oh, Oh, that sucks. How far would it be for you to go to to see the closest movie theater to, for you to go see? That's kind of harsh, kind of not. It's about an hour, hour and a half drive, you know? That's crazy. Well, that would make it a really cool experience, you know? Like it would make it it would make it more special than it is for me and me and my friends to go cuz you know, it's just like hop in the car, let's drive 5 minutes, go to the theater and you know? Nice. Nice. We just went and saw Blair Witch. And... Yeah. I was disappointed. Disappointed. It, it wasn't as scary as I wanted it to be. I'm not going to tell you. You know, it, it's I, I enjoyed it, but I was disappointed. I'll do this tons but I just I I don't get scared I don't get scared anymore so you know there, there is jump scare my wife and my friends wives and that they all jumped they all jump pretty good but me and my friends were just like yeah now I really enjoyed Rob Zombies 31 no like uh, Rob Zombie you know like uh, Devil's Rejects uh, the, the new Halloween, um, uh, one movie called Lords of Salem. Yeah, uh, that director, he just did a new movie called, uh, 31. 
It, it's a pretty epic movie. I loved it. I mean, it's not the best movie. You know what I mean? It's not a good movie. But it's a great, fun movie to watch. Like, I had a lot of fun watching it. I, I, it was so enjoyable. <laughs> oh, sweet. Whoa. Uh, well, it depends on how long of a drive. Like, if you're talking like an hour and a half and two hours, something like that? Yeah. But, I mean, if you get into the five hours and stuff like that, you never know. Never know with cars. I mean, you take the chance once, and if it makes it, then you're probably good. You know what I mean? You take the chance. You make sure you got some kind of protection, so if that shit breaks down, you got extra tires. You got everything you need. What do we got here? We got a engineer kit. And yeah, everything you need to make sure you're all right. <laughs> right? And and then you take the trip. All, motherfucking two broken Dungeoneering kits. Go suck a dick. Sorry. <laughs> Ooh, here's a chest. So this is basically done. So we're going to turn this in. Ooh, Adventure for a Talisman. Very nice. I like. All right, so now let's get out of here, and I guarantee we got to go and turn this into somebody after we did this, because that's the way this game goes. But I'm very happy to turn things in this game, because it's not like Destiny. When you turn shit in this game, you fucking get something. In Destiny, you're like, oh, hey, I just did all this. Boom, and the Destiny's like, fuck you. You get nothing. I, you know, Destiny, it, it's fun to play, but man, am I disappointed in myself for the amount of money that I put in to Destiny. I'll deal with that one later. I'm going to go and return this to Sergeant Ox Phoenix. Goddamn mission. Oh, here we go. Oh, he just threw Chucky down the stairs, and Chucky don't like that too much, I can tell you. Oh, he's bleeding from the nose. It's becoming real. That's why he gets angry. Yeah, whoever's uh, watching this video, just to let you know, you are going to become very acquainted with how to get to Sergeant Knox. Proctor's uh, Protector's Enclave is very, it's a huge rally point in, in this game. It's, you know, it's it's the main base. So you're going to come here a lot and you're going to get to know shit a lot. Protector's and here we go, finding honor complete. Oh yeah.